Everybody say hi to YouTube, despite the fact that we're all currently on YouTube. It's quite funny. Okay, let's go. Hello there, mortals. I'm Jensen. I am sick, and I am coming back to Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. I don't remember where we were, but I do remember that I love this game. Why are we not in hard mode? Wrong save. I actually have to sign into a different Steam. Oh, okay. That's Yeah, that's a great time, Steam. That's a really good time to update. Don't worry, I am really good at this game, so we're gonna be killing everything. What the hell is that at the bottom of the screen there? What is that? I have no idea what that could possibly be. Certainly not my new green screen, I don't think. Is it gone? That was so weird. There was nothing being picked up on the camera. Weird, okay. Regardless, let's go ahead. I'm glad I got that out of the screen. It, was, it looked like an oblivion compass. Also, to anyone who didn't know, compass is a compound word phonetically. All right. Let's fire into it. So we are doing hard mode already. We basically just did the opening intro so that we could get to hard mode as fast as possible. ASAP. Because massively increased rewards in hard mode. Uh, basically, every second enemy will just dump... Quickly. Who the hell is that? Why are we so short? Oh, hey there, Gobbo. <laughs> what a loose unit. So I remember where we are. I was kind of like beating my head against the brick wall of beating the griffin in hard mode. We are going to sprint around this guy. Scusi moi. Put in the moi. Uh, we gotta bust this down. That's not helpful. Come on, everybody. Bust it down. I think Val is our character. Scarby is actually our character. Val is not. Uh, let's get out of the way because I think we're about to be one hit by something. Never mind, we got iframes right in the middle of that cutscene. Very strange. Don't stop. We're exposed here. Yep, okay. Good. Let's go ahead and... Oh, I thought I could get that uh, explosive that was lying on the ground. And maybe we could have uh, kind of like blown the gate open, but that was not something we could have done at all. Okay, I'm gonna go around. Nice. And I'm gonna continue going around. Excellent. Okay, someone died. That's not really our problem, no. though. So Cyrus. Ah! No! So Cyrus! Ah! Not so Cyrus! Who is the most NPC we have? What a guy. Okay, let's go ahead and bust through here. Uh, how's the volume looking? Do we want to turn it up, actually? A little bit, a little bit more volume? Nope, that's not what we want. Want options. Controls, no. Gameplay, no. Video, no. Audio! So we want sound effects all the way up. Perfect. I'm happy with this. Is this okay? Maybe a bit louder, I think. Like that? Negative 5 dB? Let's see how this goes. I'm running! Hopefully the what griffin place. doesn't just scab us. Because it could. It may... It may actually scab us. Okay, he's taken a knight. He's kind of glitching up. There is a reason I don't have an We're up against me now. stream flag. Oh, Maybe it's the stream. It might be your Wi-Fi. It, it doesn't look like it's lagging on my end. Clear Here it comes. Your mind of all but the fight. Okay. Honorless vulture. I want to go around this guy, I think. Uh, let's go ahead and... I don't know, cast thunder on him. See what happens. I live in. One, two, three. Lightning! Okay, we did a little bit of damage. Whoa! Okay, let's use fire. That is very effective. Maybe like right here. Do we want high combustion or just normal combustion? Oh, damn. That almost one hit us. Let's go ahead and. Oh, someone used a healing spring water. That's perfect. This way or is it? Okay, good. He busts through the game. We didn't do that last time. Is lagging at extremely low quality? What are you guys talking about? I'm looking at it just fine. It's fine. Okay, let me see if any resources are being taken up. Uh, nope, everything's fine. Don't know what you guys are seeing. Really? Is it actually like that? Okay, I can't even move my mouse around. Uh, Griffin looks like he's attacking us. I don't think we've got enough stamina to actually get away from him. Just a little bit obnoxious. Is it better now? It should be better after we leave this area here. Hurry, master. Yeah, I'm, I'm coming, Scarby. Don't worry about it. Don't get your knickers in a twist. Okay, we're very, very tired. 
Uh, oh, good. Someone used a spring water. Oh, that did nothing, actually. Let's just hide in here. Come. We'll slay it from the rooftop. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. Ah, uh, perfect. We got healed by Val, who is literally immortal. Uh, we'll keep on going onwards. What else have we got? Holy affinity, fire affinity. Holy affinity is pretty powerful, actually. Uh, what else we got? We got Comestion, High Levin, and Grand Angle. So we got a lot of fire skills, which is pretty good early game. Nice. I think we've actually probably got enough to take on the Griffin anyway, to be quite honest. We probably actually do have enough. Has it improved for you guys? Has the quality improved? I hope it has. I really hope it has. Oh, that's right. The soundtrack. Yeah, so there's a reason there's no music enabled in this game right now. Unfortunately, there are some people falsely claiming copyright on this game and Capcom just aren't doing anything about it, so I have it completely disabled. It's lagging for both of us, so I think it's you. Okay, if I open the stream on my phone and it's not lagging, what are you guys going to say is the problem next? Let's go ahead and do that. I'll do it right now. I'll go ahead, I'll look for Jensen on the internet. Or YouTube Studio. Live? I don't even know how to how to look up my own live streams on uh on my phone. Pretty embarrassing. Jensen. Okay, I'm on my own channel. I'm going live. I'm looking at the live stream. Hey Larizan. My thanks again for your aid in time past. I don't know guys. It doesn't look very choppy to me. Looks it looks pretty damn smooth to me. What do you guys think? Let us see how the creature yeah? takes to Might be you guys. Magic. Might be your Wi-Fi. Or it could be YouTube. YouTube has uh, problems pretty frequently as well. There's nothing worth getting all pissed off about, though. Okay, so we got all of our stamina back. Uh, awesome. Now we're going to fight this goddamn Let's Griffin. We are a glass cannon, so we need to stay way out of the way. Oh, boost. Let's go ahead and try and cast some fire. See if we can't burn this guy out of the sky. Uh, here we go! Boom! That did absolutely zero effect. Firing for effect? More like screwing it up. Okay, uh, let's get high... No, Grand Ingle out this time. And we're gonna fire it right into this guy's face. Right into his head. Boom! Go! Go, everybody! I'm gonna do another angle. Come on! Come on, guys! Go and fight the griffin for me! I'm a glass cannon! I'll put it to fire. Okay, nice. Uh, I took off an entire health bar, which is pretty cool. Uh, I'm also a sorcerer main. Now it keeps loading over and over again. It's not doing that for me, guys. So it can't be my internet. <laughs> Hate to say it. Can't be mine. Oh, good. Oh, Gobbo was doing uh, uh, something that is a bit of a hidden mechanic in the game. He was literally throwing a uh, gigantic bomb at him. Where's he going? Hope he's not going to hit me. No, he's in the sky. Okay, that's not good. Oh, no, he's not. He's coming down. Charlie Brown, let's go ahead and hit him with a commission while he's down. Ghost Garby! Nail him! Nail him like a like a building. That was the worst one-liner I've come up with in this game by a, by a long shot. Nice! What's going on? We have just killed a griffin in hard mode in record time. Pretty damn impressive if I do say so myself. All right, let's go ahead and get Scarby to pick up all of the bits that it drops because the bits are really, really good for the Griffith armor set, which we're probably going to give to Scarby. Oh my gosh, she found a giant armor pouch. Nice. She found a bunch of stuff. Uh, she missed this Griffin pinion. A bit of a shame. Pretty good. Uh, let's go talk to this guy. I can't remember if we gave him the fake tome or not. So let's see if what he says. Did I seem the hero racing to the aid of those in peril? No. Truth be told, it was happenstance that delivered me. Really? I was tracing the steps of the sorcerer Salomet. They led me here. This guy's blushing. This guy's actually got like kawaii blush on his cheeks. Upon my arrival, I see you locked in combat with a griffin. Yep. I knew it for a golden opportunity. And I dare say I stole the show. That's incorrect. No need for thanks, sir. No need at all. Well, you're not going to get any from me. Sucks to suck. All right, let's get everybody to start looting this. It's still lagging and loading instant help us. There's nothing I can do, unfortunately. Uh, it's 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 out of my control. It's it's not on my end. I'll not letting Gobbo Lagob take that fifty thousand dollars. Actually, how much are these? Inside. It is. I think it is about fifty k. That's an assassin's mask. 
That would be- Oh my god, did you just see the jiggle boobs on Val? Nice! I didn't even realise that was in the game! How much- I've played this game so much! Yeah, it's lagging, loading, and repeating. Not for me. It's probably a YouTube end. I can restart the stream if uh, you guys really want me to. But everything will be different. The URLs will be different, or the chat will be different. The chat is super slow and it's lagging. The chat has a 10 second latency, by the way. <laughs> so that you're not supposed to get these problems. It looks like I'm transmitting everything though, by the way. So if I go... Let me show you guys. Let me show you guys how I'm transmitting. Oh, no, apparently you're right. Apparently, uh, it's not receiving enough information. What the hell? But nothing's changed. What the hell is going on? Oh, Steam hasn't actually decided to start updating everything, has it? No. Okay, what's taking up my network? I'll look it up. I'll look it up on the, um, on the old computer. Oh, no. Everything should be fine. Okay, how's that? I think that should help. Is that better? I swear this uh, phone betrayed us. The phone did betray you guys. It, it came up perfectly. It came up literally perfectly. What is happening? Uh, we have just killed a griffin. What's this? That's what's happening. That's okay. If you guys miss everything, I'm only here for the social element. If you guys miss everything, this will still be uploaded to YouTube as a VOD. You'll still be able to catch the VOD. I'm gonna uh, take a quick look around for any goodies that we may have missed, because there's usually hidden stuff all over the place. Doesn't really look like there is, though. So we'll probably just end up leaving this place. That was close. We almost just fell off the edge of the world. That would have been really embarrassing, too. Uh, now that we've actually done this, let's go ahead and just save really quickly. Because we can save and continue. And we did just kill a griffin. First go. We're stuck in a time loop. Scott's world, we're in this together. The hell? Has, it fi has what I just did fixed it? Is that better? Or is it worse? Okay, we're really, really tired. I think it's because we're so short. We may want to just change our height. Don't want to fish around that kindling. Uh, I'm going to look around before I use the Eternal Fairy Stone and we just go home. Let's do that. We're going home. We're taking the Eternal Fairy Stone and we're going to go home. Jewel of Health, Jewel of Endurance. Where is it? Eternal Fairy Stone. Uh, we want to go back to Grand Sorin, I think. Yes. <laughs> It keeps loading for the both of us over and over, so it actively has to be you. Okay, I'll show you my stream again on my phone, which is a different Support device than what I'm transmitting over here. How does that sound? Yeah? What do you think? Does that look all laggy and stuff? Oh, it does now, doesn't it? Okay. Now, I'm not actually entirely sure what to do here. I think one of my flatmates might be downloading a massive game or something like that. Because there's no additional network strain on my computer, unfortunately. I could just end the stream, make this a video. Would you guys prefer that? Kind. Not really a lot more I can do. Okay, we're in the Pawn Guild. Uh, let's take a look at all the challenges up on this board right here. Because there's some good stuff here, usually. I'm going to go ahead and accept all of these. Slay 25 crows, that's easy. Put the eye out, defeat a Cyclops, yes please. And defeat 10 phantasms, we're just going to do that anyway, organically. So, now we want to go ahead and look at the quests, don't we? We want to take a look at the quests tab. Griffin's Bane, Nameless Terror. I think we just did the Griffin's Bane. I think, do we want to kind of like rush the story and get through it? Because we missed a bunch of different stuff already, I remember. Uh, Griffin's Victory, we report the Griffin, the Victory. But where of the ambush? Yeah, we're definitely not doing that one this time. That's really fiddly. That is such a fiddly one. We probably want to go and use a scroll of metamorphosis as well, because quite frankly, our character is way too short. Gotta be said, he is so goddamn short. Maybe we change our character to be less um, small and obnoxious. He's also got an, a, a very small stamina pool too. I hear no end of... Okay, let's go ahead and store everything that we have in our pocket. Maybe a lot of these curatives, aside from the Panacea and Secret Softener, can definitely go in the storage because we've got enough. Uh, Scarby probably don't really care too much about everything she's got rather than uh, just using the uh, kind of spring water stuff that we already have. What's going on in New Zealand? Uh, luckily, not a lot at these 
these days. It's got to be said, not a lot is, is going on in New Zealand these days. Which is really, really good because usually New Zealand is famous for something really stupid happening <laughs> out in the world. Uh, pork crystal, we're going to keep that on us. Empty flask, I'm going to get rid of that. Flask of water, we probably want to keep one of those on us for a quest we're about to encounter very soon. All of these materials will definitely stick into the bank. Scarby has plenty of materials. We could probably even stick her in the Griffic Victory armor set by this point because we had quite a bit of it and we also just slew a griffin. We actually, we've slain a bunch of griffins, haven't we? Oh, that's probably enough. Day. Or is it? Have your pick. Any you like. Come okay, against. we're going to go into the inventory really, really quickly. Uh, equipment. And we want to take the Griffic Victory. Oh, we've got so many weapons too. We've also got this here fluted bow, which is kind of average. Anger to heaven, we can't use that. What else have we got? we got the Assassin's Hood. we got the Griffic Armor. We're going to give this to Scarby because she wants to be a tank, I think. A big old tank. Uh, she's got the Chimeric Half Plate. Uh, I think she'd be more suited to the Griffic Armor. Actually, the Chimeric Half Plate is, is probably a bit more... A bit more tanky, isn't it? Yeah, this... This Griffic Armor is kind of, kind of crap, and the Solar Armor will regenerate her health over time, but we haven't actually needed to use that whatsoever. Please tell me you're still here, Scott's World. <laughs> ah, it's just purgatory, my dude. It's just purgatory. Okay, we'll come up here. Just that jab. We'll manage our stored items, and then we'll start depositing all of our armors that we are not realistically going to use, like this Guardian's Hood. We're never going to use that. Because we've already got the ancient armor set, I seem to remember. What's this? Silver ring? Yuck. Let's get rid of that. Uh, Scarby has two tank pieces of armor, which we're not going to use. And she's also got a Lustrous Targe and a Ferric Talon, which I'm pretty sure is worse than what she's, what she's really got on now. Assassin's Mask on Val, probably never going to use that, realistically. And we want to go into the weapons of Gobble the Gob to deposit this Iron Shield, even though we don't really want it. It's just yucky. Gobble is, is probably the worst That's harvester we have in the game. Like. All right, soon. let's go out here and leave this place. Do we have anywhere that we could probably take somebody to? Mason to Bloodwater Beach for the recluse's robe. There's also Sir Robert to the warrior's departure. We haven't been there yet. For workers' pants, yeah. We can rest. What a revolting reward. So uh, Caxton also has something for us. Hey, buddy. What's going hey, on? A warrior such as yourself seeks always finer weapons, yeah? Yep. If you aid me in a small matter, you shall have access to weapons both fearsome and powerful. What do you say? I don't care, Excellent. but do it. So... Have you heard tell of the master weaponsmith in these parts? His talent is without measure, but he's stubborn as a plow beast and sells only to a chosen circle of clients. Okay. For such patrons, he gifts an idol. Ah, uh, the his idol quest. Known. So we want the gold idol, and that's what we need the flask of water for. I must gain such an icon and access to his wares, no matter what the cost. It's often been said you possess a talent for discovery. You can say that. Cure me a figurine. And I shall provide weapons the likes of which you have never dreamed. What all right, sounds you? good. Will you help? I'll help. The master works all. You can't. <clears throat> That's what I was hoping for. The master works all. You can't go wrong. The master works all. You can't go wrong. Do we? Can we get a better stuff? We can actually. What have we got on? Uh, kind of a piece of crap. I think we've got the grievous horns on. We can afford the favorite branches. Let's just get that. We'll see if Scarby can't get herself a uh, nice weapon too. Done. I'm going to equip this immediately. We need to deposit all of these weapons as well. We don't want them on ourselves. Good. And Scarby as well can probably do with a better weapon as well. Maybe the Taik Chinkata? We're probably from different countries and we're having the same problem. I think it's you, Jensen. Look, I'll leave the stream up in case it fixes it, but there's literally zero things that I can do from here if it's based around the internet. As far as I'm aware, I don't even have flatmates at home right now, so it could be like a... Um, a, a big New Zealand thing. There was this instance some years ago where a shark ate New Zealand's Wi-Fi. I don't know if everybody uh, remembers this, but a shark literally ate the Wi-Fi of New Zealand and we had our internet down for a couple of days because of it. That was pretty rough. Uh, I probably want to actually keep this fiery sword on Scarby because elemental damage is really, really good. What else have we got? We have not a hell of a lot. We've got an iron helm, which looks worse. We have... We could probably actually give her a better set of armor if the silver chest is out. It's not. We got the iron vest that would increase her defenses by a little bit, but drop her magic defenses. We also got the leather hard plate, which is slightly better for her piercing. Uh, 
Meh. No, I, I think we're actually pretty good for all. now. The master works all. You can't go wrong. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and we're going to look at the... Not the map. We want to take a look at the quest. See what we've got to do. We need to turn in this quest. We'll do that right this second. We'll go up top. We'll go all the way back here. Yeah, yeah, we're, we here. We here. We here. The town crier. We here. Okay, good. Um, let's go ahead and push on up here. And we'll see if we can't Salvation find ourselves the guy who gave us the quest in the first place. So I seem to remember being standing outside the gate. Now, I haven't actually played this game in months, by the way. And when I did play this game months ago, I hadn't played it in, a, in about a year. Right, uh, we'll come over here. This guy, I think we turned the quest into him. Hello, friendo. It pains me to burden you, busy as you are with the royal orders, but there is aught I would speak of with you. It's yep. a cause of worry. Though I speak only for myself and not as Chamberlain, might I beg a moment? I mean, not Skeletons really. Skeletons have been sighted near the capital these past few days. Okay. Elsewhere, I've had no end of reports of secret meetings among the zealots of salvation. Do you want me to go and investigate I cannot them? help but see the two as intertwined. Though I have no evidence to prove it. Still, I'll be damned if I allow their kind to go corrupting the minds of good people for want of evidence. Arisen, I ask this as a favor. Will you look into these events and hunt out any thread that connects them? Well, I guess I, I don't really have a choice, do I? The cult meets. I've made note of it on your map. Okay, I ask wonderful. you begin your search there. Go and learn what you can. Okay. Uh, also, can I turn this quest in, my dude? Okay, let's just go and investigate the secret meeting, right? It's probably going to be the best idea. No, let's turn this in. We're going to want to rush the early game, don't we? Above all. No, we can't turn this in. Unfortunately. Oh, that's right. We don't report to this dickhead anymore. We got to uh, keep on going on. We graduated. We graduated that dickhead and we are now a victim of the Duke. Okay, we'll come through here. Go into this door. Wonderful. Oh, hello there. What's up, my lady? Arisen, sir. Beg pardon, sir. So I she's going to give us a little bit Eleanor. of exposition from she Eleanor. Speak with you, sir. In private, if you please. Some would... Uh, Raise an they want to bugger us. Given my lady's vows to the Duke, I trust. Uh, forgive me, Arisen. I must learn to hold my tongue around proper company. Pray, find me tonight in the castle gardens. Yeah, sure. Bunko's gonna get his, uh, his, his pizzle off. Okay, let's go ahead and run all the way over here. This guy has the quest to turn in. Hello, friendo. Welcome back, sir. Then the Griffin is defeated. Yes, in record Blessed time. Relief, that. All who walk Grantis roads will rest easier for it. No kidding. It is welcome news, too, for trade. You and the others who fought have my thanks arisen. There was one guy with a book. I don't think he was necessarily integral, but he, he was there. He turned up. All right, what else have you, you got? You to see me for your assignments and no one else. Yeah? I speak for his grace on such matters. All right, so gather choice. evidence for an important trial. We in don't want case, to do that just yet because... There is a quest that we do want to go and do where we go and get the um, golden idol. We basically need to babysit Fornival's kid. By the time he sees his message, it'll probably have stopped lagging. No, I see every single one of your messages. Don't worry, guys. I see every single one of them. They are popping up. What could Lady Eleanor require? All right, we're going to well pop on through here. Uh, I do kind of like make it a rule just to make sure that I am in fact met with his streaming though. You. You're the lucky one you are. Oh, thank you, Fornable. Any rarities to sell? All right, he's not Can giving us the quest. Right then. Oh well, uh, let's convict him of murder. I think. I think that's exactly what we're going to go do. We're going to go and convict Fornable of murder. We'll pop in back here. We'll accept the quest. It's a time limited one, so it's not going to be too casual, but we are going to be able to do it regardless. Right, let's pop in through here. Nice. And we'll talk to Aldous again. Hello, friendo. You are to pray. Okay, we Make do want to do this now. You have in this and a right to hear, sir. You know of Forneville, aye? Aye. He is among the wealthiest of Grand Soren's merchants, though now he stands to lose all. Oh, well. He is accused of a litany of crimes. I would beg a favor if you've the time. It seems Forneval was as busy in his underground dealings as in his honest work. His bill of crimes includes bribery, fraud, abduction, the selling of secrets, right. even collusion with salvation. 
The inquest continues as we speak. Should the present tide prevail, he will like be found guilty and put to death. That's a lot of responsibility to put on someone as short as Opinions me. Opinions are split, however, on the credibility of the present proofs and testimonies. A few days yet remain before the matter is decided. I ask that you go and gather what facts you can. Any proof is welcome, be it evidence or testimony. Aught that clearly shows his guilt or innocence. Justice must be done. And for that, we've need of the truth. All right, fine. Uh, now, we could convict him of several crimes or... We could not convict him of several crimes and we could absolve him of his crimes. This one gives us a little bit of lore on Fornival, the richest guy in the game. Unfortunately, he is actually a piece of human garbage, which is not amazing. Not great. Not a great thing indeed. Hello there, lady. Excuse me. They're just going to shove his child out of the way while I ransack his house for some kind of evidence. Hello there, Fornival. Fornival's to remain captive until such time as he's acquitted. Okay, thanks. Let's go ahead and try and find something dirty on him. The door is closed. That sucks. Pardon me, lady. Just need to shove you out of the way so I can maybe find some evidence. What's this? Gift ledger. Okay, he has been accepting bribes. That is one nail in the coffin right there. Can we go up here? No. Okay. We did try. So now that we did that, this is basically just going to be all we need, essentially. We only really need to give Aldous the the smoking gun. One of the smoking guns. Let's go ahead. We'll go all the way around here. And then we'll go and give Aldous what he requires. Audience chamber. Yes, this is where we want to be. Great. I know that people were probably expecting lots and lots of combat. You are to see prey. Okay. I would ask you to... But the... Yes, I have this. Good. You've brought evidence. Here, I shall see it submitted to the court. There's time yet, sir. Pray, continue in your efforts. Jensen will see this message at least 10 minutes after I typed it. Uh, I saw it literally uh, the second you uploaded it to YouTube. Okay, we'll go ahead and go through. Is there actually something going on with the internet here? Because I'm pretty sure that there's not. So, we were just kind of sneaking around. We're about to uh, think about... Man, we are an angry looking man. We're about to think about the potential... The potential of, of maybe buggering the Duke's wife. Using this lady here. So if we wait until night time... Probably actually pretty close to night time. We can then go and maybe bugger the princess. Which would be pretty awesome, honestly. Maybe when the king calls us Lightbringer, which is what Satan is sometimes referred to. Maybe king is talking to the player. Or a little crazy demon controlling us. I think that we are that crazy little demon though, to be honest. Right? It's a, it's a little bit fiddly. I'm going to have to wait until the next two chapters of Deltarune are out before I start uh, reinforcing all the theories that I have. But so far what I've got is a lot of religious imagery. And uh, a lot of characters that are elevated above the game. Okay, so we just defeated the Chimera. I did locally record that on my computer, so everybody is going to be able to see that. There's a bug in here. How the hell did it get in here? I'm on my way. I just shouted help because there was a bug in the way. Oh well. No way, so that means King acts like the player is a demon. Deltarune religion have a lot of... A lot of something in some moments. Yeah, uh, I definitely, I recognize a lot of the uh, just symbols. Like, Noelle is definitely supposed to represent some sort of angel. And she's got crosses on her head, which is a bit heavy-handed for, for Toby. Uh, we kind of want to manage sword items, don't we? Or are we pretty much good? I think we're probably actually good. We'll definitely keep those on us. Yeah, we're pretty, we're pretty good. Let's go ahead and we'll go around. We'll start incriminating Fornival because I'm pretty sure that is the path that we chose to go down. We're not going to get the golden statue as a consequence, but it's absolutely fine. We just got to find a bunch of people that say that Fornival is a piece of garbage. All right, what's in here? So there should be a homeless family around here that we actually organized the eviction of because they weren't paying rent or something like that. And we chased a kid around, we grabbed him a bunch of times. There they are, hiding under the street. Hello there, child. Would you like to uh, talk about Fornival at this new court hearing? Fornival's inquest. Serves a lot right, says I. Ah, oh, sucks to be, sucks to be Fornival. I'll sign any petition you set before me if it means he'll hang for what he's done. Yeah? He deserves no better after what he did to my family. Oh, vindictive. Excellent. How about you, sir? Would you like to commit a man to death? I've heard tell that Fornival stands trial. He most certainly does. None's the pity. I fancy myself the forgiving sort, but I'll not mourn his passing. 
I'm scarce the only one he's wronged either. The man built his fortune on the backs of honest folk. The buggin here. I'll gladly add my name to a petition if it means no others need suffer at his hands. Okay, if you want to sentence him to death, that's exactly what I'm asking for. All right, he did. He condemned Fornival. Hello there, lady. Fornival's met with an inquest. Tis past time the law caught up with that rat. I'll not forget the pain he caused me as long as I live. The caitiff put my house to ruin. I shall sleep better o' nights, knowing no others will suffer the same fate. Let him rot. Well, he's not going to jail, lady. We're going to have him beheaded publicly. We're going to make a spectacle of it. There's going to be confetti. There's going to be streamers. There's going to be clowns all over the place honking their noses and terrifying anybody with a fear of clowns. Uh, it's going to be great. Um, the guillotine's going to come out. We're going, to, we're going to be executing the most um, wealthy person in the city. I gladly commit my name to the petition for his conviction. All right, based. Good, thanks. I think we've already got enough, <laughs> to be quite honest, to convict him to death. Ooh, probably not good for Fornival, huh? Oh, wow. Look at this guy. I bet he lifts. Okay, let's go over here and... Steady on. We need to hand in these affidavits, don't we? Which is kind of like a legal document uh, for people who can't be there in the moment. It is actually a thing. Why is this guy running? And where's he running to? Sir, stop. Do you want to commit a man to death? Where are you going? Cease. Okay, I knocked him over. I think he's just gone for a jog. I, I think I just harassed a man while he was going for a run. Uh, there's a skeleton key over here. Let's go and grab it real quick. Boop. Nice. From day to night, and we'll come around here. Completely different. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? I just knocked over the same jogger twice. That feels really good. Hello, lady. Excuse me. Just knock her over. Now, I did notice in Dragon's Dogma 2 that when you bump into people, they actually lose affinity for you, which is really funny. I've detailed our nearest estimate of their meeting place upon your map. Above oh, that's right. This guy... Oh, booze. Above this guy uh, wants us to go and investigate something, which we'll probably do while we fill in the time for... between now and when Fornival is going to uh, be decaffeinated. Okay, we'll come up here, and we'll go through these gigantic double doors right here. Nice. And through these double doors next. And would you look at that? Aldous stands next to the throne, ready to accept our condemnation. Hello. You are to see me for your assignment. I pray. Yeah, I've got a bunch of stuff I for you. Ask you to see here you go. The Take this here. A uh, condemnation. Remaining. A petition signed by Jasper, pressing angrily for Fornival's conviction. Done. Don't Good. know who Jasper is, but here. here we go. Okay. Now we are going to hand him Sarah's condemnation. A signed petition calling for Fornival's conviction. Good. You've brought bye bye, Fornival. Oh man, he's gonna you rot to in hell. Good. We've I got one more. This one, you'll be pleased to know, is from a child. A child Good. who doesn't understand the intricacies There's... of politics. Ah, I'm actually feeling lighter after that as well. That's pretty funny. All right. Best of luck for hitting. Chopping the guillotine. You don't want to take a few chops. Just embarrassing at that, at that point. Okay. So we need to come back here at night time to bugger the Duke's wife. Maybe we do that. Maybe we do not. I think we do that. I think we do that. Maybe we go and sleep until uh, potentially nightfall, and then we. What could Lady Eleanor require of you at such a well, met, sir. well, Scarby, let me tell you about the birds and the bees. I know she's just got a uh, a very flat love lump, so unfortunately she doesn't have the facilities to uh, be able to enjoy a night's lay with the Duke's wife. It's it's. I feel like it's. Probably more of a trophy thing, right? I like these graphics. It's realistic, but at the same time, not too realistic. I know, this game is actually gorgeous as well. It came out in 2011 as Dragon's Dogma, and then it got remastered in 2013 as Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. 2015, it came to PC, and people started modding it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to do a sleep right here. Let's rest until nightfall. Understood. I think Scarby would have gone off and assisted others in the realm as well, so uh, we're probably about to get some rewards. I love this game, by the way. This is one of my favorite games of all time. I never finished it on YouTube, so I'm coming back to play it uh, as kind of like a comfort game while I'm sick. I also have Dragon's Dogma 2. Ah, perfect. Okay, Must Die from Friendly Fire gave us some riff crystals. Nice. Uh, my best friend Carl, at least this right here, uh, Elizabeth earned us 42,000 riff crystals. But also, someone who's not my best friend, I don't even know who the hell this person is, Albert gave us 60,000 Rift Crystals. Which is kind of weird, because now Momo is uh, best friend and Alesis is not. You're sick? Yeah, I, I've, I've got a, a mild cold. Cold. Someone gave us a pumpkin. At least it's not rotting. 
Ah, oh, helpfulness. Come on. She's amazing. I hope I was able to please you, Arisen. You most certainly did, Scarby. You do you, you based queen. Yeah, no, I'm sick. I've got a mild cold. I don't know where I picked it up from as well. Usually you can track a common cold back two and a half days. And if you can think of what action you were doing at that time within like an hour, then you can very, very accurately gauge what got you sick. And usually what gets me sick is someone I take a mental note of who I walk past in the supermarket who just kind of looked run down and sneezed or something like that. That's usually what gets me sick. But this time, I have no idea what it could have possibly been. I haven't had I've a gold in a while, though, so... Aye, the air off is a clean bed, but it deals in vocations and skills besides. <laughs> Thanks, Gobbo. He's got this gigantic nose as well. It doesn't suit his voice. What a dick. I hate cold so much. Each time I get cold, I always wish I never existed. Yeah, I know. I also have an immune disorder, so... Uh, I get sick, and it lasts for, like, a week, maybe two weeks. Whereas other people can shake it off in a day. It's a real damn fart, but, you know, it is what it is. I'm quite lucky in the sense that I'm cautious enough to only really get sick maybe once a month. At, at worst, I would say. In a good year, I'd, I'd get sick, like, once across winter, and that'd be it. So this is probably my once across winter. All right, we're going back to the Duke's domain, and we're going to bugger his wife. I've never got a cold for only one day. Yeah, me neither. It's ridiculous, isn't it? You might have an autoimmune disorder, though. That, that could take into effect. I definitely have one. So we want to uh, meet that lady, don't we? The Nightwatch is currently on patrol. So we got to be real fiddly around here with who we speak to. Whoop, that was close. We almost just got detected. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and go over here. Because I see that lady over there. I don't know how people have such short colds. I bet it's like a, neuro uh, a neurotypical thing. Come, oh, this is glorious. Most glorious. Yeah? Tell me more. Uh, pardon me, sir. Forgive the ramblings of a handmaiden on a strange errand. It's only... Milady's request to see you is a rare thing, you see. First in all my years with her, in truth. Really? I trust you understand the delicacy of the situation. Milady is a married woman. I need not remind you. Yeah, I get that. Duke wants to watch and uh, she wants to get plowed. I've been in this situation before, lady. You think this is my first rodeo? Look at this face. Look at this face. I've been invited to many, many cuckoo places. And well, yes. Even innocent conversation could be bent foul were it discovered by others. What? Are you saying that maybe cuckolds have a bad reputation? Hold your tongue, lady. Pray, walk softly, Arisen. And have a care to let none find you visiting Milady's chambers. Because <laughs> oh, uh, she, she's speaking in code now. She's speaking in code. All right, we're going to gap it into the tower. I am going to absolutely haul ass. We are going to go and plow the Duke's wife. We're going to plow her like a farm. I don't care who's around here. I'm going in. Nothing can stop this D from swinging between my legs. Hello there, Osifit. I'm just going to go bugger the, the Duke's wife. Let's go. Walking past the throne. Haha, -ha, a little bit of a flex right there. Up here I go. Hopefully there's no one up these stairs, because uh, I'm going to bone them. <gasps> Let's go. Anybody up here? Let's see. No, 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 no. Excellent. The princess at the top of the tower needs a good buggering, and we are fit for duty. Yo, yeah, what's up, lady? My warrior has come for me. Not yet, he hasn't. But believe me, he will. You must think me a shameless harlot. No. Would that words could prove my love is pure. Off to a nice fire in after a long day's ruling fire. No, you must hide. There is a fool to fulfill that dragon. Yeah, quickly. You storm the lady's bedchambers with the urgency of a man in battle. <laughs> Who's buggering my wife? Oh, fear not. I shan't eavesdrop on the ducal proceedings. I remain to stand watch of the guard, sire. For your protection, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Bless this Festus. He is literally Where salivating. Would you had mentioned your coming, I might have dressed more finely. 
You get away from my lady. You watch. What are you? Lenore. Oh, my love. Forgive me. Don't worry, nothing under water is going to happen. Is something. Forgive me. I was wrong. I take it back. So, this guy is king. This guy is king because he made a deal with the dragon. I think he exchanged his last beloved for him. Ah, we well can gather at the spot right here. Set of servants, Gar. Perfect. Anything else? Lake of Brew. Good. And there's also some purifying brew here. Good. That's good loot. Um, I think maybe we interrupt this, right? Because this probably isn't a good thing. Maybe we, um... I'm coming! Duke! Cease your strangling! So, you, uh... You wanna watch? You wanna watch this tiny little man have a crack? Well, what have I? So the Duke is not particularly attached to uh, her because she is not his first love. This wicked fool mistook a trifling kindness that I once paid for something more. He stole into my room. I was terrified. She tried to bugger me. Oh, he knows. This commoner must be made to learn, sire. Commoner? Give him a taste of the lash and a stay in the dungeon. Do you not see these robes? Thirsty. Would they look better on the floor? Thirsty, I know you're there. My lady is mistaken. I would never violate his grace's privacy while he violates my lady's privacy. Oh, bring <laughs> none of your japes, fool. Summon the guards. Have <laughs> this villain removed. <laughs> Hi, Eleanor. I'm gonna give you to the dragon. You will be devoured. Mark my bosom. Well, now, what have we here? Friend of the Duchess, sneaking off to her chambers for a cup of tea. Cup of tea? No, it was for buggering. It must be a fine tea. What to come all this way in the dead of night? No, no, we were gonna bugger. Or perhaps you seek refreshment of a different sort. Like a turn in the sheets with his grace's own wife. Well, now we're talking. <laughs> Damn. You're tougher than you see. That's right. It excites me. Perhaps I was hoping to do this in the bedroom. This is in business after all. Oh, look. She feels bad about what she's done to us. Ah, oh, well, just goes to show, right? Bros before hoes. Never trust a duke's wife. Here she is. Hey, I still got a bit of stamina left if you, uh... I know it's not the most romantic place, but uh, there are worse. There are way worse places. What have I done? I cannot ask forgiveness for this betrayal. But I was certain the Duke would cut me down where I stood had I not spoken so. He was cutting you down where you stood. You dumb oaf. Damn, <laughs> look at our chest. Oh my god. He's a lift pro. You must run. He got short man syndrome. Half mad and fierce and wroth. I shall think of some way to assuage him. Hello there, Mr. Purple. Sorry, we're just going through a real touching cutscene right now. We tried to bugger the king's wife, but unfortunately, uh she she gave us some bad apples. Okay, how are we getting out of here? There's a large mushroom here. I've got one of those. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, if only I could give it to the to the princess. You made the suit? Uh, Red Rux is probably actually asleep. It's quite late for him at this point. The lock opens. Okay, we escape. I think. Hello? We do actually have our own skeleton key. But I don't necessarily think we're able to use it now. Can we just walk out? Is that how we escape? 
No! There was a guard up there. Uh, that's not how we escape. He's coming down. That's bad. That's a, a real big bad thing. I don't think we can put any equipment on. Yeah. So I think there's a way out through here. Or is it through here? Hard to say, actually. I think it may have been through here. Let's go ahead and use the skeleton key here. I got to sleep in 19 minutes. Did you literally just come in to tell Red Rux that, uh, that his, his prison suit is made? What kind of suit did you go for? All right, I just punched a spider to death. There's a rat over here. I'm not going to punch a rat. Come on. I think I am a monster. Snakes! Oh, I'll definitely punch those. Or not. Yep, I punched that snake. I just got two punches with that snake in a row. Our health is literally almost down. I just punched that snake to death as well. Uh, let's keep on going this way. I'm gonna punch that spider, because they're gonna spit some venom at us. They already spit some venom at us. That's not good. I think we can actually already equip the, uh, our equipment, right? Maybe, like, if we go into the... Yeah, we, we can. Nice. Alright, let's, let's equip the flavoured branches. Right here. Equipped. And we'll go down to head. Equip this tiara of enlightenment. We got these set of servants... <laughs> we got breast. <laughs> It looks a bit monkey looking. Yeah, I, I made him intentionally short. I tried to make a pop, a Funko pop, but uh, he just ended up turning out as a really, really sad short man syndrome lift bro. Okay, uh, legs as well, cotton hosen, yes please. And also ancient greaves, yes. It's got enormous feet as well, if you'd care to look. And we also need a couple of rings. Stuff various rings, pretty good. Uh, Baleful nails, actually pretty damn good early game because we need the extra 10. That's better. Oh, look how powerful we are now. It's a good thing they allowed us to have all of this uh, stuff down. Down in jail, huh? I was talking about the suit. Master, you're hurt. How did no? this happen? Oh, I tried to bugger the Duke's wife and he, he didn't take too kindly to it. I interrupted his strangulation. Oh, well, not my problem. We're off. Okay, uh, down here is the sewerage. Let's see what's in this chest right here. It is desiccated herbs. I could not begin to give uh, two dams about desiccated herbs. So we should pop out of the waterfront district. Good. Yeah, we're in the slums. Excellent. So we're going to be poisoned for a wee while. I don't particularly care too much. Uh, I'm just going to walk through the sewage. Because Funko likes the flavor of it. He's short enough to get a nice mouthful when he goes through. All right, we want to go up this here ladder. We want to sprint up it because we've got unlimited sprint. Oh, it looks a bit monkey looking. The suit you made for Red Rux. Gotcha. Well, he shouldn't have cancelled Half-Life 3. What a guy, huh? What a guy. You get known for something and uh, you'll never be able to shake it. So, whoa. I was wearing, that guy's dressed to the nines. There's a dickhead over here. I'm going to shove him while I run past. His fault it is his fault, isn't it? Yeah, he shouldn't have, he shouldn't have sentenced uh, Gordon Freeman to death. Also, if nobody understands the inside joke, uh, Red Rux uh, sentenced Gordon Freeman to death. Shove that guy as well, stick my arm right, right up his right, bum hole. A different country, okay, so country. let's go ahead and check our map for the next quest, because I'm pretty sure that we got a, whoops, we got another... Oh my god, how do I move the map? Oh, it's just to the edge of the screen. We gotta go and find, not Wimbluff Tower, was it up here? Great Wall Encampment. What do we have? What? Hold up. What, what What? mission are we even doing? Trials and Tribulations. Okay, I could not care less about that. Let's do Rise of the Fallen. We've already sentenced uh, Fornable to death, fortunately. So, search the capital to learn anything. You can not only have Salvation's clandestine meeting, but also the cult's involvement in the skeleton skirt. I actually do think this is one we can do here now as well. I don't like the chat delay. It's very far. Hey man, the stream was crashing this time an hour ago, so uh, I'm pretty happy with the stream delay. It didn't really, um, it didn't really help though. Man, this poison won't go away, will it? Okay, let's go and find. I'm pretty sure I know what to do here. I think we need to follow one of the knights around. I'm not entirely sure if that is the right quest that we're following here, but we are going to find it. I'd yep. would never tire we'll come down here. Gobbo the Gob literally will not shut up. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, this is the objective? Is it really? This, must be uh, this is probably a nighttime thing, right? Okay. 
let's go back to the inn and we'll also do a sleep while we're there because we need to do so. And we'll also deposit all of these billions of weapons that we have in our back pocket. It's quite an obnoxious thing. Uh, we'll come in here. And now we need to talk to Asalam. Asalam alaikum. Have your pick. Go Can ahead and manage stored well, item first. Do? We'll deposit all of the crap we don't want in our pockets. Like these billions of weapons. We don't need any of them. Uh, do we have any armor? Yes, we got prisoners' rags and servants' garb. That's fine. Do you use a green screen? Oh no, I, I just paint the um the back wall of my office the same color as uh, as the game. <laughs> of course, I use a green screen. Well, I actually just today? got a brand new green Have screen, so uh, you, you shouldn't see a lot of kind of like artifacting and tearing in the background anymore. I got one that uh, that fits my frame better. Okay, perfect. So we deposited that. We forgot to sleep. We want to sleep here, don't we? Go ahead and do a sleep. Have your pick. We'll rest we'll until today. nightfall. Understood. And then we'll see where Salvation goes, because we need to follow them. Even though I've got a vague idea of where they actually go. Accessing server. I highly doubt we're going to get more rewards from Scarby, since Dragon's Dogma 2 is already out, and it's, it's basically Dragon's Dogma Plus. It's so good. It's such a fun game. It's just such a shame that there's frame dip in the cities. Just a little bit of frame dip now. They fixed uh, most of it. Manage inventory and skills and so on. You should wear a green shirt for a stream. I'll tell you what, actually, there is something that I could um, wear that is green for a stream. I think you'd like it. I think I think you'd uh, I think you'd really like it. How's this? How's this? Is this good? Do we like this? Is this exactly what we want to see? <laughs> okay, uh, let's go find Salvation. <laughs> I know, it's been sitting next to my desk for about four months, and this is the first opportunity I've had to pull it out. I was going to do a thing in Payday 2 where I just kind of like put this on every time I mask up to, to rob something. All right, let's see what they're doing. What do you make of this new plan the High Conclave's crafting? I know the aim's to sow chaos, but still, I can't but think it's excessive. Talk is those walking bones have slain three of our own, and we're to let such creatures roam the roads. Aye, if we're so ordered. The rest of the Conclave's design relies on those skeletons to draw off the Duke's attention. Right, so they're distracting the Duke, so we can bugger his wife, I think. Our thirst is greater than I thought. Tis time to send word to the others. What others? Come, no more doubts, brother. You're to begin work under the Conclave soon, no? What a dunce. Aye, I'm bound for there now. Tis my first time. <laughs> I was surprised at the summons, truth be told. I've not been with Salvation long. I suppose they trust me. I'll not miss the hellish life of a messenger, I'll tell you that. Who cares? Now, I'll tell you one thing about this mask that is actually really handy while sick. You don't need to blow your nose on anything other than inside the mask. And it's, it's quite nice because all of the, like, snot and the, um... And the boogers and stuff that just explode across the face when you blow your nose into the mask. Uh, it, it insulates the mask, so it's nice and warm. Very, very good. Very nice. There is a... <laughs> my god, I didn't realize how good that looked. <laughs> yes! No one can tell, but I was smiling beneath that mask. Literally, no one can tell. Okay. Okay. So... Now, we want to harass this guy, don't we? <coughs> Sorry about that giant bird. You! How long were you there? The whole time. What did you hear? All of it. The skeletons. Not just me. Damn my luck. Yep, even worse. I'll not hang for salvation. It was only a way to earn some coin in the first place. They pay a tidy sum for finding new believers and sending them onto the Conclave, though. I suppose my hand in that ends today. That sounds like an MLM, doesn't it? Let's be civil here, friend. We're not enemies, you and I. Surely we can strike a deal that benefits the both of us. Yeah, sure. How about you get three people to sign up to my cult, and they get three people to sign up to my cult as well. And uh, every time they do that, they pay a tithe of like 50,000 bucks. When you're done, you should check your insights. Okay, I'll check your insights after this. 
I give you a special bit of merchandise in return for a stack of coin. Yo, that sounds like a great deal, my dude. Actually, that sounds like the um, bare essentials of commerce. Well, will you help me put this dark business behind me? Why am I paying this guy? I just caught him doing crime. Ah, well, we already sent this man to death. Let's good, pay this guy a grand. Good. Pray, just tell no one it was I what gave you this, eh? No, I'm going to tell everyone. We, you also need to give me a, a receipt. It is a key that will allow you into their sanctum. Kind of expensive, don't you think? What you do once you're there is your business, though I doubt you'll manage much. Wow. I feel more familiar with his quest this now. Wins us entry into the I love how none of the uh, characters that we're with had ever seen that outcome before. Everyone just killed him, it seems. I'm not chasing him. We're sprinting over to the inn, which we shouldn't be doing. Sorry, I, uh, uh, my back just cracked and it caught me off guard. And the server? Oh yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll check it in the server as opposed to um, any other Yin Saints that I have created. Alright, we're in the venery. We want to take this turn. We want to go straight from here. We want to shove this lady over. I missed. Uh, and it also threw us off a little bit. Oh no, we are so lost. Where the hell are we? Uh, we did take a wrong turn, but fortunately we can backtrack a little bit over here. So that we can see the Forge Master just over here. Hello there, sir. Would you like well to duplicate this key that I just paid 10,000 sure buckery booze for? Boy there, why not? Uh, you know what? Actually, why would I bother? Why would I bother give him that? Because we can just pay... We've got so much money. Why would we do that? We're not going to do it. I've, I've actually decided we're not going to do it. But while we're here, we might want to see if we have another idol that we can kind of like duplicate or maybe some rare materials. Like uh, Magic Metal, they're pretty rare. Dapple Door's pretty rare. Griffin Pinion's pretty rare. Griffin Claw, nice. Freakish crap, don't care about it. Snakeskin, that's pretty easy to get. Silliman's Secret is pretty hard to get. Serenity Extract? No, we're getting into consumables now. What else do we have? Uh, Miasmite Shard? Maybe. Necrophagus Loin? Uh, it's a zombie's cock. That's what we've got right here. Mmm, buckery booze. I know, right? It's so nice to be uh, um, an, a serial killer, so to speak, because then you can afford to be very gener generous with your wallet. Got an elongated claw here, harpy pinion, yellow poison sack, that's weird. Uh, what's this? Wolf pelt? Yuck. There's not really anything that we necessarily want to duplicate yet. We haven't really got anything useful. I'm sure you'll find all you need. All right. Oh, well, sorry, well, this isn't the uh, menu I wanted I'm to go sure. to. I wanted to see his uh, store because we have a little bit of armor. I don't think we got the hand plates, did we? Do we get the Do we get the gauntlets? What we need? The ancient bangles? Yeah, that's exactly what we have. Okay, what about Scarby? What can Scarby wear? She is probably in the market for some new feet, honestly. Whoa, these look awesome. Do we just want to, like, dress her up fashion souls like? Heroes Queases? Or maybe Chaos Greaves? Emissary Greaves? Chaos Greaves? Maybe? What about Chaos Everything? Maybe just Chaos Everything? Chaos looks sick. Let's see the, uh, let's see which torso has the best one. Chaos Armor looks sick. Uh, anything else? No, not really. Okay. Would putting souls in suits count as killing? No. No, it would not, I would say. Uh, Hero Surcoat looks pretty cash money. Marshall's Braces looks pretty sick, actually. I do like it. It also increases her strength. So maybe we just give her the Marshall's Braces. Done. And then we also give her the Chaos Armor Set for a nice bougie look. Chaos Gauntlets, no. Emissary, no. Heroes Gauntlets. What about the Hero Set? I, I, the Hero only has a surcoat, so it's not really that practical. All right. Let's do Chaos Set. Okay, uh, we will go for the Chaos Gauntlets as well. Sure, why the hell not? And there's also Chaos Greaves here, which look pretty damn awesome. What about the capes? We'll probably have to flip her around, right, to see behind her? I can't flip her around. Oh, yeah, I can. It's right mouse, and it takes absolutely forever to turn. All right, so Monomi Neck Wrap looks like ass. Heroes the Cape looks pretty good. Heresy looks like ass. Wormheart Mantle looks pretty good. Beastly Mantle looks pretty pretty meaty. Conqueror's Mantle, bit of a meh. I think Heroes Cape. Heroes Cape with Chaos everything else. That's only half a million bucks. We can definitely afford that. Let's change our equipment. Okay, Scarby, I hope you're ready for all the good stuff. So let's give her this here, Marshall's Braces. We'll put the Chaos Armor on her. And now we'll go into arms, we'll use the Chaos Gauntlets, and we will also whack on Chaos Greaves. Maybe the 
Lion's Spine would be better. It's pretty tanky. When does soul number two get to talk? Soul number two? They don't get to speak. No. I, I, I just say actively no. Half chain hose. And, okay, so we've got some pretty good stuff on her already. Wormheart mantle on the back. Let's change that to the hero's cape. So that she looks a, a little bit more intimidating. Yeah, that's good. Okay. I'm sure you'll find all you need. Anytime. We're done here. Thank you, buddy, old pal. Where is Scarby? Does she actually... Jesus, look at her. Whoa! The smoke coming off of her. She's literally burning in real time. She looks sick. She's terrifying, actually. Jesus, I'm actually scared of her. Uh, please don't speak, uh, Scarby. I'm terrified of her. What about next stream? What do you mean by soul number two? If you're talking about Yint Set, she's not here. She, she works a day job. I have the luxury of uh, not needing to work a day job on account of my health, so... I'm always, I'm always here at home. Managing the place, basically. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of all of Scarby's previously worn yucky stuff. We're going to deposit... Uh, what are we depositing? Probably all of this crap. Why did she pick up a spade? What is wrong with her? Nothing on the head. Uh, Maiden's Cape is all. Pretty good. I'm just gonna go ahead. Oh, that is so much better. Excellent. Sorry, I was just clearing my nose without uh, blowing it into any anything. Uh, Gobo Lagob has unfortunately just hijacked the inventory screen. Good. And Lion's Spine as well. And we also want to get rid of this Chainmail Skirt because it sucks. And this Wormheart Mantle is pretty nice, but, well, you know, have have we have basically just life. kitted Scarby out sure. with um, probably pretty good mid-game gear, I would say. Here probably. Manage inventory and skills and no, my number two? What, do you mean like a poop? I don't think Pooh talks. All these workers going about like, Conker's Bad Fur Day is probably the only interpretation of Pooh talking that I've really seen uh, in video games. So, un unless you're talking about some other video game Pooh that speaks, maybe that's the game. Didn't Conker's Bad Fur Day get remastered? Maybe I should play that on this channel. That's funny as hell. That game was so good. It was a really good game, despite it being uh, quite obviously satire. Crass well satire. All right, it's night time. We are going to go out and we are going to follow this road and we're going to go to Salvation. I hope everybody can kind of see what I'm doing here. My second soul? Undead! Okay, oh, undead! Let's go ahead and give ourselves Holy Affinity. Yes. Die, scream Scarby. Ah, that's why we keep the uh, fire sword owner. Good. Okay, Val is still doing a bunch of, um, a bunch of spells, which is pretty helpful, actually. If we get happened upon again, I'm pretty sure we're just going to use the old holy trick. Because essentially, holy is as OP as it gets. What do you mean, this way? Why are you going that way? Look at the map. Look at the mini-map. Where? Show me. Uh, is Adam there? Not for long! Oh, I think yeah, this is part of the um, nameless threat interaction. Okay, we're gonna have to do a lot of dodging because we, unfortunately, do not do a lot of damage. Gobble the Gob finally just actually did an attack. Scarby is uh, walloping these guys. I think they're all trying to cheese each other with health clouds, but it's not really going so well. Okay, good. That's one dead. Kill this! Boom, 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 boom! What's this? Alrighty, good night. Good night, Mr. Purple. I hope you rest well, unlike an Ultimate Custom Night, where you uh, very clearly did not rest very well. Okay. We almost did that damage. We almost did that damage to Jeff. He had a funny death animation. What a dick. Oh, there's one guy over here as well. Oh, well. I'm, I'm just gonna mash him with my, uh, with my fist. There we go. Good. I used a bunch of key attacks, but uh, it, it didn't quite do a lot. Okie dokie. So, where are we going, actually? Let's check the map. We are nowhere near where we're supposed to be going. We're going to the catacombs. Didn't we already go through them and end up out here? I'm pretty sure we did. Let's go down here. Let's, let's hope for the best. I, th I think if we go down here, then we might actually be in a really, really good spot. Ah. Is that barred? No, it's open. Ah, very nice. Okie dokie. 
so there's a spider right here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, try and take out all of the spiders in the area with this holy magic That's missile. Because nice. probably, um... Probably the weapon that we are using if we were doing a genocide run on this game. Because it just one-hits so many enemies from range. You can actually get away with just firing a bunch of these into a room and it takes everything out. Because they tend to home in on enemies. Uh, I think this leads up to that big boss fight that we encountered in the crypt. Oh, hello there, skeleton. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Thank the Lord for holy. Oh, hello. There's more of them. I almost just got charged. Pretty lucky. Good. Oh, my God. Hello there. Bunch of skeletons coming at us. Uh, that one tried to thrust us, but it didn't quite work. Good thing they're weak to, to magic, huh? Go on, Gobbo. Oh, no. It seems like Val got the kill on that one. Great. Uh, let's go ahead and give ourselves holy affinity once more because we kind of need uh, to get through here. It's pretty important. And bing, bang, pop. It's on our staff. Okay, it's a shame we can't see anything. I can kind of see something. I don't know if you guys can see anything. All right, here we go. Light. Uh, there's a skeleton about to attack us. Oh, well, sucks to be him. All right, let's wait a little bit, and then we'll attack him again. Go, Scarby! Attack! Okay, good. There's another one coming. Fortunately, he's got his guard up, but we are penetrating. Hilarious. Man, Scarby is becoming a bit of a grappling legend. What the hell was that? I saw a flash of light in here. Uh, let's go ahead and check the map of this place so that we know where we're going, huh? How does that sound good? Probably sounds good, right? Okie dokie. Uh, change the scale with a no, not interested in changing the scale. We probably do actually need to be all the way over here, unfortunately. I'm just going to push through the catacombs and where we end up is probably going to be where we needed to go in the first place. So it should be pretty good. All right, we'll come up here. What are we looking at in here? Bats! That's lucky. That's unlucky. Okay, we there is the bat. Good. Now we want to come up here because it's the easiest way through by a pretty wide margin. I lied. There's no way of getting up there, unfortunately. Let's just push on. Good. I got a holy out. It didn't really land. We're still getting attacked by bats. Bats actually do an annoying amount of damage. Okay, there's a couple of bats here. Let's go ahead and just uh, use magic missile. Take all of them out preemptively. Good. Oh, there's a chest here. Huh. A restless earring. That's not something I want. I have insomnia. I definitely don't want to use that. That is a big no-no. Big L. We found a big L. What? Is this a cutscene? What's going on? Did I go the wrong direction? Did I break the game? What's this? What? Huh? Huh? Okay, we popped out under here. Catacombs rear passage. Let's just walk. Let's just walk up here. Because quite frankly, we're probably uh, not going to find our way through the catacombs. Just kind of like guessing. And again, I haven't played this game in a long time. So we are literally just guessing. Hey there, sir. That is a hell of a sword you have there. Bye-bye. Okay, good. We may be attacked by skeletons or zombies along the road here. It's well ancient, this bridge. Yeah, well said. I hope it still holds. Yep, me too. Scabby has a has a lantern on her. It's not actually doing anything. Here are the skeletons. Let's go ahead and take them out from a distance. Because they're really annoying. Uh, and Holy is really good against them. Nice. Oh, there's another one right up here. Let's go ahead and take this thing out. Whatever it is. Any more? I think there was actually. Yes, there was. But finding me. Nice. All right, we'll come over here. Ah, uh, right, we've got another one of these uh, nameless red guys coming after us here. He may. Why is he fighting on the same side as the skeletons? Damn, that was close. We almost just bit the dust there. Thank God we went out for that um, huge amount of health regeneration. Never mind, we are dead. That's embarrassing. So we're going to respawn outside of that cave, right? Jesus, look at the fight. There were so many skeletons and stuff out there. We're probably going to have to treat this like a bullet hell, honestly. Let's just treat it like a bullet hell. Probably makes the most sense, right? There were so many enemies there. That was so crazy. Maybe we should be using wall of fire. Might be a good idea. Okay, I wonder if we're going to find the same person over here. Guy with the big sword. Yep, there he is. He's got the immortal helm as well. Already? Huh. 
Crazy. Uh, I'm actually going to go ahead and I'm going to use Holy Affinity on myself right now, just in case we get into a scuffle preemptively. Good. I'm still tiny, by the way. I'm still a very tiny man. Okay, let's start firing these out because they're going to home in on the nearest enemy anyway. That was weird. Uh, they missed. Strange. You don't see that much. Yep, okay. There's some attacks right there. There we go. We're landing hits. But not very well. Oh, sorry about that, sir. I didn't quite see you behind us. Uh, Scarby's in combat. No, she's not. We are good. Let's go ahead and use the mischief. Go. Go, everybody. Go, go. Very well. Go, go. Two arms. Okay, let's, let's fire this one kind of where they that are. Up here. Can we go any further? Let's no, we cannot. We probably should have gone for an we angle, I think. Boom. That did nothing. That's embarrassing. Okay, we'll try angle this time. Uh, not on that one. No, 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 no. All right, where are these enemies at? There's a couple of them up here. here. I'm going to fire the these off. Of which we'll see us to our I think they missed, but we oh, definitely the saw them. He sheds the mortal coil. Oh, piss off. I am he who treads where death Good. is. Good. And I'm grand angle. Let's fire it. Oh, insta kill. I am he close to the ground. I, I am he in which is really, really close to the ground. The hell is it? I don't care. I we literally do not care. Are, are you all here? Your life belongs to us. Who said that? Triumphed. Is there anyone else here? Scarby just said there's no one else here. You dickheads. Oh, there's a bunch of uh, ghosts over here. Maybe we want to take them out. Yep, let's do that. It's on the way to the... Well, it's not really on the way to where we need to go, but... There we go. Killed one. Funko got up to level 47. Very cash money. And there's another one. Awesome. Uh, I think we're about to be attacked by one of them. Not amazing. Not very cash money. Let's go ahead and just fire these off. Uh, sun is rising too, so I'm just kind of farming these guys. Awesome, we found a Myers my shard. We only had one of those, I remember that. Uh, there's another one right here, I'm gonna take it, and also this hundred bucks, which wasn't even worth stopping to pick up. What's that? Let's continue this away, and we may find ourselves, oh, did you look at that? Myers my shard and What's a giant this? coin pouch with 10,000 buckery booze in it. Love that. Awesome. Okay, we're gonna keep on going this way, and eventually we should find a entrance to the catacombs. I'm actually going to save because I've got a bad feeling about what we're about to come across, and usually my bad feelings pay off very highly. They pay dividends. What are we about to come across? Uh, just a couple of skeletons. That's fine. Okay, holy affinity on myself. Everyone go. Engage. Engage. Let's scatter those bones. Okay. I cast. Uh, I blast. Move on their own. Boop, 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 boop. Good. I'm gonna hit that ghost next. Never mind. The ghost is impossible to hit. Did I hit the ghost? What's this? Yes, I did hit the ghost. And now the ghost is dead. Nice. A couple more skeletons just over here. Not for long. Ah, oh, well, sucks to be that guy. And there's one skeleton over here with a two-handed sword. He's not gonna make it. He didn't even make it to us. What a plebeian. Oh, well, look, it's the healing spring. That's where we found all of the really, really overpowered uh, healing items. Good. What the hell is that? That's Cyclopes. Uh, we could probably actually just go take it on, just for fun. They're not particularly difficult. And we're now at level almost 50, which is pretty damn good. Okay, the reason I didn't do a lot of damage on that is simply because he has armor. I cannot preach his armor. Yeah, no, I was just explaining that, Scarby. Okay. Run! Whoa, that was close. <laughs> he's coming after me, but he's not going for it. Uh, yeah, we've got a couple of hobbledy gobbledies after us. They are not happy with us. Good grief. Cease! Good grief! Okay, I'm firing. I'm firing my laser. We took half of our health and damage, which is just absolutely fine. I probably want to focus on the ads, right? Instead of. Why are you auto targeting the Cyclops? Stop doing that. Okay, we've got a little goblin there who's a bit of a tank. But he does have stagger. Rain attacks upon his legs. Yeah, rain attacks upon his legs. That's a really good idea. How about a commission, guys? 
How about we just put a burning wall of fire beneath it? Had you guys considered that maybe a burning wall of fire underneath its balls would actually cook it in a really, really good way? Mmm, smell that. Smell that delicious sautéed uh, uh, Cyclops penis. Excuse me. All right, let's start taking out this one because he's a bit of a dick, actually. Uh, Leave us alone. This guy's harassing us. His helmet is off. Even in numbers, Good. A weakling is a weakling still. Go. That's Garby. Take him off. Very well. Good, 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 good. Uh, I'm firing at his knee. Whoop. That was close. That could have gone real wrong. Let's go ahead and stun lock him. I'm pretty sure that uh, electricity stun locks them, right? Boom, 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 boom. Yep, there we go. He is stunned. Go, guys. Go, go, go. Go, go, gadget party. Okay, I struck it in the eye. Let's go ahead and fire off a wall of fire now that he's fallen on the ground. The reflexes are coming in real hot and heavy, by the way. Boom. Awesome. Cook Cyclope's eye. That's what I like to see. I am now going to uh, fire. Oh, he just covered his eye. What a dick. That's not very nice. Go, Scarby. Penetrate his armor. Uh, we are doing physical magic damage like this. Nice. I think Gobbo just fired a, a huge amount of arrows into his eyeball. Gross. Yep. There is an arrow sticking out of his eyeball. I am pretty sure that is what killed him. There he goes. What a bastard. What an actual bastard. Do you guys get enough bits of him? Let's check his taint. Nah, it looks like, it looks like we got it all. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do another holy affinity on us. Excellent. And boop, on the stick it goes. Nice. Oh, they were guarding a chest. I can't believe it. All right, good. Uh, Jewel of Health. I could not care less. I literally could not care any less than I do right at this moment. We're being attacked. Let's go ahead and holy him into the into the ground. Go on the ground, sir. Go on the ground. No, strength and power. What the hell are you talking about, Scarby? They have the numbers. You oaf. You oaf of a woman. Have you even read Sun Tzu's The Art of War? Good God, lady. All right, focus your attack on the tank, please. Good. I got him. Nice. Yeah, I know. I watched him die. Took a wee while for him to uh, go on the ground, though. It's pretty funny. Okay, so we are pretty close to the catacombs now. Anything around here? No, 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 no. Uh, let's push in this away. It is daylight, so we're in a pretty good place now. These enemies are going to be significantly squishier than they were at night time. That's kind of how the, the leveling system works in this game. Oh, we took out the guy I didn't want to take out. And we also alerted the annoying tank. Oh, Gobbo just took him out with one arrow. Pretty impressive, honestly. Uh, this guy crapped out a heap of money. Let's go ahead and pick up that money, because I, I want it. I want the money. There we go. Nice. Yeah, yeah, let's slay the leader first. We'll do that right this second. Oh, sucks to be that little tanky guy. Uh, let's go ahead and fire off a few more of these. Excellent. He didn't even make it to us. Pretty good. This is like protagonist kind of combat, right? Because all of them are coming at us one by one. I feel like the main character in this game. This game does do a good job of making you feel like the main character. What is that? Nothing. Yeah, I know Gobble La Gob. We are literally standing on them. You dunce. Good grief. The nerve of that little green man with a giant nose. If you come to offer prayers for those who rest here in the catacombs, really? Do you think it's because of all of the undead down here? Okay, good. Val is looting. She found a mage's pair wrapped, and she's probably the best person to have it as well. That's going to increase her magic damage. One of the two. Oh, we can actually just take this all the way down. Oh, poos! That was close. Whoops. I almost just died. Embarrassing. Okay, good. What is that? Aspen milk. Thank you. Nice. Aspen juice. Thank you. Do not mean if I do. Jesus, Val. Be careful. The walking dead are all around us. All right, I'm firing. I'm firing my laser. Uh, we need holy. Tis weak to fire. Yeah, I know. We've been here before. You know that they're weak to fire. Why did you shout that? Okay, let's fire these off. Ah, oh, well, sucks to be that guy. So, probably not going to find another bunch of people coming up from the ground. 
Oh, hello there. Yeah, I see it. I love how Val is just all like, look, in front of you. A heap of dangerous enemies. Watch out. That is a huge crowd of enemies. All right, I took out the big bloater. Uh, why did I explode? I believe some of the Goblin just are throw a barrel we'll of fire that. at me. What a twit! What an actual twit! Oh, hi, lady. Good thing I sprinted past that. Pardonnez-moi, mademoiselle. Pardonne. I'll show you stout undead. All right, good. Got a few more in the cave right here. Let's go ahead and just take them out from range. We don't really have to deal with them. Uh, this one crapped out a huge sack of money. Awesome. Giant coin pouch. Thank you very much. Ten grand. Yes, please. Now, we could... I just found a pickaxe. Cool. We could light all of these braziers, but I think it may cost us to do so. Oh, I'm doing it anyway. I'm doing it. I like this. Everything in this area dies. There we go. That's something we're not used to. Being able to see. Weird, huh? Oh, look. Money. Nice. What are you guys fighting? That thing? Anything else alive? This looks nope. interesting. Nice. Okay, so we're on the other side now. Uh, we can hit this. Oh, we could have just jumped across here and then just summoned the elevator, right? Whoops. Whoops. I just found some rotten ambrosial meat. Nice fur. We found that for us. I'm getting on. Yes, good. And down we go. Perfect. Structure is built from a natural cavern. Yep, I know. Half a labs inside. Okay, there is a chest right here. We're gonna loot it. Point pouch. Waste of time. Waste of our time. Take out all of these spiders because they are um, basically poison farmers. I hate them. They're real bad. You're not good in this game. Usually, I'm kind of like a trap and release kind of guy when it comes to spiders, but in this game, I'm more of a don't take chances because they give us poison damage kind of guy. What's in here? Nothing. I hear a zombie. I uh, haven't spoken a word. Not a word. I see a bunch of them. You must believe me. Oh, do you hear that? Someone's lying. That's the guy who sold us the key. That was the arisen. How could I? Please. That guy's buggered. Oh well. I'm, what? Do we want to go this way? There's a couple of fights down here. Look at all this. Bang, 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 bang. Did we just one hit everything in this room? I think we did. Did it. Nice! Is that a Rift Crystal or a Myers my Shard? I'm going in anyway. In case it's some Rift Crystals. Probably don't need to, necessarily. I'm gonna go ahead and give myself Holy Affinity as well. I don't really care about that guy who sold us the key, necessarily. He I, he could be doing something bad, he could be doing something good, he could be being tortured right now. That's, quite frankly, beyond the purview of why we're here. I'm lighting this. Yes, that's right, this is the face of he who kills you for the second time. Good. All right, now we want to grab this giant sack of money because I like money. I do like money. We want to come through here, right? Because we've got a key. What do you mean we don't have the key to fit it? We just paid an arm and a leg to get this thing. You dimwit. That guy actually just gave us the wrong key, I think. Where? Is that it? Okay. That is literally it. Die! Did it. I love how she's shouting die to a zombie as if they aren't already dead. A skeleton mage Hello, skeleton mages. I'm quicker. I can also stun lock you. Ah, oh, well, sucks to be them. I'm lighting this. Stop Bye -bye. incantation. Here you battle. I did. That's exactly what I did. Okay, so we've cleared this room. Scarby is currently grave robbing. Jesus, lady. My God. She's a crazy woman. What's that so, treasure, we don't actually want to go the way we're going, do we? In fact, we don't even want to be on this floor, necessarily. We want to go all the way over here, it seems. So we could go backwards. We could go, actually, it does say dead end here. There's a lever here. I'm pretty sure that opens this gate that we've already followed down. So, why the hell is this here? Let's remove it. Can we, can we remove it? Yes, we can. Good. Uh, there is a ladder here for the third level underground. I wish there was a way to be able to kind of like to see the different layers of of the dungeon, which is a little bit of a shame. Oh, perfect. So we want to go to the first level underground, I think. The first floor, maybe? No, there's no way through there. We want to go to 
There is a ladder over here which takes us out of the cavern, I think. We want to go up a floor, don't we? Which is probably going to be up this way. Realistically. So we're facing the wrong way. I want to go this way. And then we want to hang a left. Hello. This I'm coming through. Whatever's in here. Uh, we want to go in here. There is a chest in there. There is an. There's another way. I know. Okay, let's take out these uh, skeletons. Good. In fact, let's summon all these skeletons. That was probably a bad thing. Oh, I just found some set of salvation robes. Uh, they've got all their backs turned, which is awesome for us because we are peppering them with everything that we have. Good. Excellent. Uh, gonna keep on firing away behind these skeletons. Uh, thanks, Scarby. You just threw a bomb at me. What a girl. Is that everything? I think that's everything. I what's inside. What's okay. That? I'll check the time. All right, guys. I have to go. Uh, thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Um, it's been a it's been a really really weird session, especially with the internet fiddling around as it is. But I'm gonna uh, condense all of the Dragon's Dogma stuff down into one vod, so nobody misses anything. So thank you so much for watching. Right up here, you're gonna find the playlist for Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Right up here, you're gonna find another playlist that I think you really enjoy. Down in the description of this video, you are going to find a, uh, a link to my Discord. That's that's what it is, and you are going to be able to find me and my community there. Why not reach out? Why not reach out and have a conversation? Uh, we like to talk a lot of crap there. And again, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video that I make or the next live stream that you catch. And goodbye. It's cocked up everything in that outro. Damn the sick brain.